In this video tutorial, I'm going to share with you how I created this text. It's a picture that I inserted into the text. So you cannot find this, this color, a color to this text, text looking like this exactly. This is a picture I have inserted into the Microsoft Word text. So in this tutorial, I'm going to show you the basic step-by-step -step on how to do it. So let me try to delete this. Now let me write something like that. Or Let's say welcome to my channel. You can select the text and do whatever you want with it. You can play around with the different features that you want to play around with. You can um, increase the size. You can change the sizing also manually from here. We can add in different kind of um, font style. You can just add different font style accordingly, according to what you want. And you can do all sort of things, but the coloration you cannot get that color and you can see you can only change color to different color maybe you can even have gradient color or the about you can see more color options and you can see different different kind of colors that you can add none of them is suggesting you to add a picture directly so let me show you how to add that picture so i need to delete everything from here so let's select and delete now, where you're going to find that is you have to come to insert and it's going to be in the smart art. So just click on smart art. You can see them differently, but the one I'm going to use is on the list selection and it's the first one here. So you can see, although there are about five of them, I can just select from click on the edges of all and I can just delete, click on this edge also and delete, click on the next edge also and delete. So I have this one to myself. So this way I'm going to type in my text whatever i want to put inside the image in so let's say welcome to my channel and i can select this and change the font style to any font to make it a bit thicker so let's come to the home and i can select something like this skill sans i kind of like it a bit and i can see now everything is done so once you well, once you have the text selected you can come to format over here you can come to format and you can come to this is a text field features and this is the shape field features so you stay with the text field click on this drop down and you can see more field colors you can come to picture directly and you'll be able to insert any picture of your choice so as you know, i want to insert this swimming pool picture i can just click and insert it and with just one click you can see it has inserted my picture into the text now, some people might say you don't want this background. You may not like the background color. I uh, can get rid of it. So just make sure you select the, uh, the text or the shape on its own and then still come back to the format. And right now you can see this is the shape fill. So you can come select the shape fill and say no fill. And once you click out and click or press escape, you can see now you have your text completely filled with that picture. So another alternative way to do the same thing is you can click out and maybe press escape and you can select the shape, double click on it, and you can come to the same text feature. You can see these properties, the format shape properties, and then you can come to the text option over here, and you can see the different features. This is the text, text view, and you can see text outline. You can see them over here. You can check the other ones, the shadow, the soft edges, the 3D formatting, you can see everything you can decide to play around and add some um, glowing effect to the text but then this time around we're interested in only the text options so you select the text options and you select picture or text field so you can select and change the image from here by just selecting you can select and select another image maybe you want to put in different image this one you can select and you can just insert it with just one click and you can see You'll be able to play around with the different features if you want this is the shape features if you want to add in some shadows you'll be able to add some shadows as well directly so you can see you can add drop some shadows and i think it looks much better than before so it's very easy you can add different features you can play around with you can add soft edges if you are interested or you can add reflections if you are interested so it's very easy you can check from the range of reflections that we have while still selecting the text, you can add different kind of uh, reflection. Uh, so you can see you can now add different kind of reflection effects. So it's all up to you. You can play around with the text feature and uh, the images and add different kind of image and see how you can play around with it. This is just a bit about how to insert an image into a text. I hope you enjoyed this video, ladies and gentlemen. Thanks for watching and I look forward to seeing you in the next one. Bye.